Hi, I'm Drew Kleber with Minnesota America Corporation. I'm here with Jeremy Banks, our National Data Management Specialist. On today's tool tip, we're going to be talking about the new D2 standard. So Jeremy, I recently received my new input tool and my UAV transmitter, and I noticed something different right away on these. It has a D2 stamped on each one. Uh -huh. Also, here's a new MDH micrometer that also has a D2 logo. So uh, what exactly, what are we looking at here? What is the D2? So Drew, uh, D2 stands for Digimatic 2. Digimatic 2 is our high resolution uh, Digimatic output. And of course, you'd use this for a connection to SPC cables, and then you could use that to send data to your statistical process control software. Okay. so. Why D2? Okay, well, D2 is high resolution. So as you come with these uh, newer gauges with a higher accuracy, higher resolution, you're going to need to be able to have a output that will accommodate that number of um, decimals. So for example, uh, the MDH mic can output to 5 millionths resolution. The D2 standard will support up to 1 millionth resolution. So I can output the data from this gauge in both inch and metric to its full resolution. As long as everything has the D2 on each component. So does this all work to what you're saying? Does it work like that right out of the box? Right, right. So um, to work, you have to have a D2 gauge and you have to have a piece of D2 Digimatic um, data management equipment. So for example, I have a, a D2 MDH and I have a D2 input tool. So if I connect these together, it'll work. Now, of course, to work, it has to be set to D2 mode. Okay, how would I do that? Okay, so um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to do that. So first you're gonna press the mode button. Now I can change the settings of the gauge. I need to toggle to the output mode. Then I'm gonna press set. Now I can press mode again to switch between D1 and D2. So now I'm in D2 mode. I'm gonna go ahead and press set again. And then I'm gonna hold down mode until I'm back in the uh, measurement mode. So now that I've switched to D2, I can hook up a piece of uh, D2 Digimatic data management equipment to the port and I can send data. So what if I get the new D2 gauge and I have existing data collection equipment that does not have the D2 logo on it? Okay, so if the data management equipment does not have the D2 logo, then it will not work with the D2 signal. Okay. So you can set the uh, measurement instrument back to D1 use your old cable, it won't have the high resolution, but it'll still be a working tool. Oh, okay, I understand, perfect. Well, thank you so much for that information. I hope you found this tooltip useful. If so, feel free to like and share. If you have suggestions for future tooltips, please leave them in the comments below. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to reach out to us at 888 Mitsutoyo or visit us online at www.mitsutoyo.com.